Developmental dysplasia of the hip describes a group of conditions where, for whatever reason, the hip does not develop normally. And the socket, the acetabulum, um, isn't deep enough for the hip to work normally through childhood and over a lifetime. And it turns out this condition where the hip uh, simply is not fully developed causes mechanical problems severe enough so that the hip can wear out. And this wearing out is called osteoarthritis and it's the commonest cause of uh, total hip replacements um, in adulthood. And uh, this osteoarthritis, which commonly causes, uh, is caused by childhood hip conditions, um, it's a major cause of uh, disability in adults. So developmental dysplasia is the commonest cause of this osteoarthritis of the hip. And it's the commonest uh, childhood hip problem that, uh, that we orthopedists see. It's uh, genetic to some degree. Um, that is, it does relatively strongly run in families. So if uh, a parent has had this condition as a child, one should always be very sensitive to looking for the diagnosis um, in the children.